Yeah, hi, here I am again, talking to you guys. Welcome back to another super awesome video here on Marcus Sims channel. Now, as you might see in the title of this video, it says how to time travel. Of course, I'm going to teach you or I'm going to share with you some awesome steps that you can do on how to time travel back in time. Uh, but I'm not talking about that sci-fi, you know, fiction where with time machines and all that kind of stuff that we seen on movies and all that really awesome stuff, right? No, we're gonna make it very practi practical. Okay, guys, are you ready? Let's get on with the steps. the music the music is one of the best way to time travel back in time I mean it doesn't matter if you listen to an old country song from Taylor Swift or one of the music from the Backstreet Voice boys it doesn't matter it's going to automatically transfer you to the past and it, I mean it always happens you go to the movies and then you start the movie you know shows you a song and an old song and, and you know it kind of brings you some nostalgia and almost all the time when you hear an old song it can bring you a lot of good times good, good memories that you spend with a, maybe a friend your family uh, when you were listening to this music together or maybe your neighbor uh, used to <laughs> hear the type of music when, maybe when you live in another city you know it it brings you memories from that, from the past that, you know, maybe today you cannot see this person that you listen to music with, or maybe you uh, a family member that's no longer here or whatever, you know, you can sit down, you know, on your house or whatever you, you can find peace and listen just to that old song on YouTube or other platforms that you hear music. Relax and time travel with your mind to, the, to that memory, to that time. So yeah guys, music, music, music! There's another way, very easy for us to use to time travel back in time and that is photograph, pictures videos maybe probably back in the day we don't you know people didn't you know record as much as today uh, today is not the same when we record memories today we record just to i don't know if someone is fighting we record it if something explodes we're recording if something is looking for trouble we record to have proof whatever to upload it to youtube facebook whatever but back in the day i think that the recording it was mainly used to have memories you know to to save that moment when we probably made our first you know steps every one each of us have an, an album like this yes back in the day uh, people used to save pictures in books like this albums maybe there's oh probably there's bigger albums but I believe and I, I, I have a feeling that a lot of us have albums like this that you can ask your parents about uh, old albums with old photographs, pictures or maybe your grandparents, maybe they, they, they probably have an album like this with old pictures of yourself, your parents and you can get this album and just see it by yourself on your room, on the couch and you know, and be, you know exploring, remembering Going back in time when we when we when we used to dress like this, our haircuts were very different. The skinny that we wear, it is really nice, very effective way to time travel back in time is by looking at old pictures, old photographs of us, of our parents. Also to remember good times when we, you know, maybe we have a, a a family member that passed away and we we have pictures of of us with them and you know it's really nice to remember the good stuff that we you know used to to do with our, our family members or maybe a friend that passes passed away or someone that we we don't talk anymore 
the key of everything is to remember everything that is really nice that everything that makes today us stronger and like i said for videos uh, it is very difficult to have a, a video of us maybe i don't know probably uh, some of you might have more videos but if you have videos you can ask your your parents or your your grand grandparents about you know all bhss cassettes of and to have a lot of fun you know remembering how funny your face were back in the day <laughs> another way to time travel back in time to remember those times where you know the city where you live or the, the path that you used to walk maybe the, the secret entrance i don't know there's something i'm pretty sure that we all have really good memories about you know the city the location the, the, the town that you used to live it is a really nice way to time travel if you go again today to that city to that town So I had a little phone where I just used to record the song and then listen to it later on but I only could re record it like 30 seconds of preview of any song and then I used to you know from school to my home I used to you know listen to that 30 seconds over and over and over so yeah those times were very simple very very different from today going places all places all street that's a good way I'm drunk. <laughs> There's another way that I always use to time travel back in time is by watching old school uh, TV, te television, you know, pr programs, commercials that, you know, you, you used to watch during Christmas or, you know, normal day life. Back then we, we used to, to watch a lot of commercials about toys and, and I feel like today we don't get to see many of that. You know, th times really change. It is really nice to, to go back in time and, and, and to see all this gold stuff that we get to, to watch, you know, when we, when we were little. All those television programs, all those shows that we used to watch. So yeah, like watching all, all commercials and all TV programs, it, it, you know, it helps me a lot to, to time travel back in time, to remember those good good days, good times when we were little, when we, when nothing, you know, when we were not worried about anything, you know, it was just simple back then. And you know, I, I think that it sometimes is really good to escape from reality, you know, just to, to sit down and, you know, search on videos on YouTube, old TV shows, cartoons, even commercial from the, you know, 2001, 2005, all that around that, that time. So yeah, that's a really good way that we can, you know, go back in time and have, have a little fun. It's just to stay right there, just for a couple of seconds, and then we can come back in today's reality. And finally, my friends, another way to time travel back in time is just by spending time, you know, thinking, remembering all those good times that we used to, to spend with our families, with our loved ones, our friends, all of that combined, you know, just sitting by yourself in your room, you know, in a really peaceful place, and then to start remembering everything that we had and even the things that never happened. You know, there's always a reason why things never happens, stuff that we never got. There's always a reason why those stuff happen. 
you know, ended up by happening and by not happening. You know, even thinking about remembering the, the, the bad stuff, you know, today that situation can make us stronger, can make us more mature, can make us more, you know, to, to value everything that we have today, to be more grateful of what we are today, to, of what we have. That's how I you time travel back in time. So in conclusion, my friends, that's how you time travel. I hope you use this uh, step, this method, just for you to, to do something else, to, to remember those good days, and maybe bring some some of that good stuff from the stuff that you used to do, you used to, to make or to think, the way of thinking, I don't know, everything, all the good stuff that make us better today, we can always use it. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you have enjoyed this very different video. So thank you guys for watching and see you guys very soon.